as far as being back at City Field, it's fantastic. Um, you know, you don't realize until you're away how much uh, this is in your blood. Um, as far as uh, how I feel, um, it's kind of the unknown. You know, I, I don't I don't know what my stamina is going to be like um, uh, in the game or uh, or voice wise. So we'll. Um, um, if Keith is talking a lot, you'll know. <laughs> the SNY analyst and member of the 1986 World Series team has been out since the middle of April after having surgery to remove a mass on his chest. The prognosis after the surgery was that the cancer was treatable. Darling said he'll take it easy for a while and then he'll hit the ground running when the team goes to Atlanta in a couple weeks. I really didn't have any feelings about myself. I only had feelings about um, my three sons and my wife. That really was the only thing I thought about. A lot of hugs, handshakes, and welcome backs this afternoon by the members of the media. But Darling said the support from the Met fan base has been unbelievable. He's received around 5,000 get well messages. You feel like it's just a little personal struggle, challenge uh, that you have, but so many people want to uh, uh, make sure that you feel as though um, uh, you have their, um, uh, their hugs. So it's... Um, it was, I don't know. I'm, I, I'm still trying to wrap my brain around that one, too. It's uh, completely humbling. Darling will be in the booth tonight and then take a lighter schedule before going full force, as he mentioned, when the Mets hit Atlanta in a couple of weeks. As he said, quote, the doctors will continue to closely monitor me over the next several months to assure my progress remains on the right track. End quote.